Good morning, YouTube. Say hey, Dexter. <laughs> I don't know. I feel like I'm back to day one right now. This is bad. I don't know. Maybe it's just a bad day. But it is currently um, 11.13. I've been up since like 8.30. Just sitting around. So even to get up that early, I guess, is better than where I started. I think I'm just getting too discouraged. This is... This marks the end of week three, starting week four. Yeah, in a week, I'll have been on this for a month. It's a great, you know, a great mark to have, you know, a great stepping stone. Um, but I'm still at 158. I didn't lose any weight. If anything, I gained like a pound. <laughs> and but I'm trying to get the mindset of it's not all about the scale. It's not all about the numbers. Uh, so here's the thing. Um, I had a comment on one of my videos not too long ago saying keto can only last so long if you don't take some supplements that you need to help it last longer. And I know this is true now because, um, you will hear me the end. Thank you. Uh, because I am so weak and have no energy. Um, just standing up, I get dizzy. And, um, from what I've looked into and what I believe we did before is magnesium and potassium supplements, which is in the shakes that Garen takes every day, um, the, the chocolate Walmart shakes. And I don't drink those every day, um, and he does, which is why he feels fine and I don't. So I did order me some pills off Walmart that are magnesium and potassium supplements um, for like 100 tablets, only like $9 and you only have to take a pill a day. So I'll see how well that works for me. And until then, I just need to make sure I have a shake in the morning to keep me good and going. So I am home <clears throat> and I'm drinking me one of these. And I think the reason these do usually help me feel better and why I feel like I can't go a day without them now is because it does have a lot of potassium and magnesium. And as you can see, a whole lot of other stuff too. Just a lot that's like really good for you. So a lot of protein, some fat. All right, so um, it's a few hours later and we are heading back out and heading to church. Um, and I look like a ratchet mess, but you know, um, it's crazy how much better I feel after having one of those shakes. Garen's having one right now um, to even help him, him feel better. Good morning, YouTube. I just had to share this cute little moment. She do doesn't always get on my chest like this. She's so adorable. So uh, I've had my shake this morning and I am already like feeling better than I normally do in the mornings. I think those shakes really like make or break me. <laughs> doing it. I might not even get a chance to work out because I am doing it. Do you see this mess? Do you see this mess? Hopefully in this next clip you see this mess. This mess will be gone. Alright guys, this looks so much better. Yes, it still needs to be swept and mopped and wiped down, but I got the majority of the junk out of the way, so... Whew, that alone felt like a workout. Proud of myself. Alright, so we just got through eating some Mexican. We're literally just leaving. Literally all I had was like one buffalo wing. I just wasn't too hungry. I had that and some chips and queso, but not much. Um, but this is the times where it's so hard. Like I hate dieting right now because we're in town and like the biggest thing I want to do right now is like let's go get an ice cream cone or there's like a pie safe and uh, we've got a fudge shop. I just love being in town. This is my favorite area and usually our date nights would be like go walking around town and we'll go eat here and then we'll walk over there and get some dessert. And so yeah, that kind of sucks, but it'll be worth it to get the bod for the cruise. Good morning, YouTube. I'm having a late start this morning. Um, well, I've already been up, um, but I've just had a smooth or not smoothie, those little Walmart shakes for my breakfast. And now it's about 12 o'clock and I'm ready for lunch. 
So I think what I'm gonna do, since I still have some leftover wings from yesterday, I think I'm gonna have that with a margarita pizza. And instead of making two pizzas, I'm just gonna make one. And I even have some celery and ranch. Um, so I can just like have like a whole pizza and wings meal. Um, and I think that's what I'm gonna do. So that'll be kind of cool. Good morning guys. Um, I forgot to vlog this morning but all I had was another one of those shakes to hold me over and I'm just snacking right now on some celery and some ranch for like a snack. Um, I'm getting discouraged because I have slacked off with um, working out like I should but it still shouldn't be affecting the scale as much as it has. I've been like at 161. 160. I have still been eating right, doing what I'm supposed to do as far as like my dieting. I just wouldn't think the exercise would affect it that much. Um, so it's definitely pushing me to exercise more than I have been. But yeah, just getting discouraged. But that's how my morning's going so far. Good morning YouTube. I'm sorry I haven't vlogged this morning yet, but again, all I've literally had this morning was a protein shake, so not really exciting. But I am fixing lunch today for Garen and his family, and so that's nice, and I'm doing all like healthy, and this is what I'm doing. Fixing some fajitas, chicken, steak, pepper stir fry, um, and some onions. I'm gonna be uh, baking some tortillas. By the way, I probably should turn on my oven to get those tortillas ready to bake. Fixing some cauliflower fried rice. It doesn't have much longer to cook before I rinse that out and get it all fried up. Um, this is all the ingredients that I'm putting in it. Um, I'm gonna be putting some chopped onion, broccoli stir fry. I've already put this on my fajitas to give it some good flavoring. This stuff is awesome. And we're gonna be doing sesame oil, soy sauce, and I thought I might try ginger this time. I saw that on TikTok where someone put some ginger in there. Y'all might notice I have rearranged some of my kitchen in here. These were sitting over here up against the window. Let me close this cabinet. I put some pictures up. They're not, you know, it might be a little cluttered, but you know, I just, I needed something. Kind of cover up the paneling because I'm tired of seeing these ugly brown wooden walls all the time. And it's gonna be a while before we can replace them. So I'm just like having to put something up in the meantime to just like keep me sane. So yeah, that's what I'm doing. Fixing some lunch and it's kind of fun, but yeah. Alright guys, so I think I'm going to fix a different kind of smoothie before church. Something I haven't fixed before. Sorry, Garen's gaming with Ethan, so you'll hear him in the background. Um, but I found this that I've had in my cabinets for a while and I really need to use it. It's um, cookies and cream uh, whey protein powder that is like meant for shakes and stuff. So I figured I might try to make something out of this. I might pull some stuff together, see what could go good with that. I for sure will be putting some coconut oil in there. I might even put some peanut butter. Peanut butter and cookies. I think that would go good. Um, and of course some heavy whipping cream. I can't decide on what else to put in there. But yeah, that's what I think I'm going to do. So this is what it ended up looking like. And uh, the texture is pretty good but um, I think I put too much coconut oil in it but it's still pretty good nice and tasty mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm vlogging <laughs> but uh it's definitely it tastes like a peanut butter milkshake with like a hint of cookies and 
the coconut is like throwing it off. Next time I won't put so much in there. I might just put one tablespoon instead of two. But yeah, it's pretty good. All right, guys, it's the end of the night and I think I am going to go ahead and end this vlog here and go ahead and start editing and post this one, put all these together. I know this is probably a lot all in one, but thank you for bearing with me on this. Um, what I am still frustrated over, which I even checked my weight tonight. That is something that I have to remind myself of. <laughs> Let me keep on track. Um, I weighed myself and I'm at 161, which isn't the best, especially seeing as I was at 157. I don't know why my weight is fluctuating like this. It's driving me crazy. But what I have to remember is at the beginning of the month, at the end of the night, I was weighing at 166, you know? So to lose like five pounds in a month is really good. It, I mean, it really is, you know? <laughs> um, and it's not even a month yet, really. It'll be a month on Wednesday. So, you know, I need to stay positive and keep with the positive vibes. And so that's what I'm trying to stick to. Yeah, my weight is fluctuating, but I need to remember where I started at a month ago and looking at the scale and freaking out and seeing, wow, it said 166 at the end of the night. I need to get on track, you know? Um, so, and I feel like I am, and that's the main thing. What I am starting tomorrow, and I mentioned this to y'all before, is my mom has offered to let me come with her to work out at Planet Fitness as her guest with her black card membership. And I think I finally am ready to start that with her. Um, so it's gonna give me a boost, I'm hoping, and, and you know, a, a workout buddy with my mom and just a reason to get up and moving and to get out of the house and not, not just do it in the house and not be such an introvert. So. Yeah, I'm looking forward to that. That'll be kind of the start of my week. Um, so yeah, thank y'all for joining me. Um, I hope y'all have a good, blessed night. I'll see y'all tomorrow. Bye.